Can you see me? Everybody's dead today, or? You guys are so quiet. How about the Ryan Hamilos? I told you the yesterday. Is not ready, sir. Go. So I've just come from breakfast with a very high-ranking, extremely high-ranking government official. Uh, not the top, and he's never been the top, but he's been relevant and he's been around uh, since the start of the SAR, which was uh, 25 years ago. So it's my honor and pleasure and privilege to have a constructive breakfast meeting with him. It also f adds further legitimacy to everything that I've been doing on every front. So if you still don't think I'm legit, and you're not willing to listen to Joe Rogan and Tom Segura, who, by the way, have just also certified my legitimacy, uh, then I don't know what to tell you guys anymore. But what I will tell you is we make amazing stuff. Look at this. First, you guys just gaze. I mean, isn't it just brilliant? You'll probably ask, what the hell is it? What the hell is it? What the hell is it? Well, I'll tell you what it is. It is Piacenza cashmere. Three-ply Piacenza cashmere, okay? Which is... <laughs> It's completely whip stitch. This is hand knitting needle and knitting yarn threaded whip stitching on the collar, on the v neck, down the front of the jacket. These are real mother of pearl buttons on the shoulder, on the sleeves. I love these tram lines on the cuff. It goes behind the collar as well, down around the jacket, on the magnificent patch pockets. I mean, this baby is just brilliant. And yes, it's Piacenza Cashmere. Uh, and I'm gonna call a client and show him the finishing touches that I've put on this in a second. Let's get to the first client though. I did not schedule any calls today because I did not know uh, what time I'd be done with this meeting. So let's see who picked up the phone. And I have no qualms about this being a short call because I'm beat absolutely be. So let's try Hoboken, New Jersey first. I'm typing Hoboken so we can find name. It feels so weird. I've not uh, had breakfast in the longest time ever. And I didn't work out this morning. I had breakfast. I feel like shit. I feel like, you know, I haven't slept or something. And it's a gloomy day. And I wonder if this client will pick up the phone. And if he doesn't, it's okay. Like I said, I didn't schedule anybody today. Hi. Are you okay, buddy? How you doing? You on the stream or no? Uh, no, no, actually, I wasn't on the stream. Is that your shower curtain? No, no, it's just a curtain. I'm in a different room. I love it. That curtain is awesome. We need to make a lining out of it. <laughs> Send me this curtain. I, I will build you. Like that. I'll build you a blazer from this curtain. Yeah, no, I'm so sure love to hear that. No, I'm serious. I, I think the curtain is absolutely sensational. We've got to build you a blazer from it. Yeah, okay. Let's do it. I want to show you something, okay? You know who Joe Rogan is? So then maybe so, so even Joe, Joe Rogan thinks I'm legit. Yeah, I'm super happy. Why is Celeste? She doesn't want to be part of this? She's, I think she's in bed. She's sleeping. Look at what I built you. Oh my goodness. That's it's exactly what I wanted. That's awesome. For sure. It is supreme, isn't it? I love it. I love the patch pockets. I love it. <laughs> Pinhole hidden in the roll, very slight accenting colors in the buttonholes. Okay, you okay with that? Yeah, yeah, no, that looks great. Very slight accenting. Okay, yeah, just a little bit of extra stitch down in the buttonholes to give it a bit more depth since we're not going to go, we weren't going with really uh, contrast in the color. 
okay? You'll feel that the, the, the stitching is a bit more vir virile. I've gone double rounded on purpose, just to give it a bit more depth. Can you see that? Yeah, no, I think that looks great like that. Fun patch pockets, not boring ones. A little bit of a curve and kick for you. Okay, so it looks very bespoke. Classic breast pocket with a pull out pocket square. Well, of course, you can put your specs in there and business cards and anything else. If there's anything you don't like, just tell me, yeah? Yeah, yeah that was great. Fully line patch pockets, real horn buttons, functional cuffs, overlapping buttons. These horn buttons are magnumous. Uh, you, you'll see how gorgeous they are. Narrow semi-notch lapels, slight, ever so slight roping in the shoulder, very soft shoulders. Glorious interior line, absolutely sensational interior line. Nice sweat cap, looked at the same fabric. The Tim McLaughlin. Uh, uh, what? <laughs> Let's bring this pride. Uh, these little flaps, the Tim McLaughlin flaps, you've got on both sides. You can obviously open that up. You don't need to secure everything. Tuck it in for easing and out. Cigar pockets here, one and two. Okay. Is that what you wanted, right? Two cigar pockets, and then you've got another one here should you need to use it. Lower pockets for the smartphone and charger. Everything piped on the inside. Look at that Angelico fabric. I, think that, I don't know if this is your first stab at Angelico, but it's great that we're doing different things for you. Yeah, it right? is. It's great that we're doing different things for you. So, absolutely stunner of a jacket. You're going to love this fabric. Two short, small vents at the back. And the flannel under the collar. I think that looks great. That's great. A gorgeous That's waistcoat great. to go with it. Oh, that's great. Absolutely beautiful waistcoat with corresponding little patch pockets. So here's your Rian. Yeah, I love that. I love that. Here's your Roshan, right? And here's your Rian, right? Direct copy. <laughs> yeah, that's great. <laughs> okay. One, two, three, four, five, six button waistcoat. Very interesting waistcoat that we've done for you. We appreciate all the discretion that you give us. We want to build you stuff that's different every time. So a V top and a square bottom. Okay, V top, square bottom, deep press stitch everywhere, real horn buttons, back of the waistcoat is fully lined. So this look is, is very akin to a hunting suit, a country suit. So very old school Americana, the cut of the waistcoat. Just need to see, do the belt at the back. Do you like this cat? Yeah, I think it looks great. That's yeah, is it, is it, isn't it awesome? It goes so well with it. So good, right? Something different to continue to add to your repertoire. Yeah, absolutely. I'm we don't want to, no, we don't want to build the same all the time. Oh, and I forgot, I built you this pin. Yeah, I saw that, the pin looks great. Isn't it great? Yeah, that's, it's the yeah, first of many. First pin. I love it. Your first pin, and you can wear this on any uh, jacket you want. All right, just okay. slot it into your hole. I know that sounds terrible, right? Just slot it yeah. into your hole. Now, with the pins and the three rolls, okay, you can decorate down here also. Okay, do you get oh, what yeah, I'm saying? That's cool. You can decorate down here as well, and it's a very cool look. I promise you that. Yeah. I promise you, it's a very cool look. So I had this meeting with this uh, very interesting high-ranking government official today, and hopefully some fruition will come out of it. And even if it doesn't, I think it just adds to my legitimacy that you know I can meet these people. Uh, not necessarily on demand, but have the access to, you know, send them a WhatsApp and say, hey, let's hang out. So here we go. Great look, huh? It's everything you wanted, yeah. right? And you were very patient with this. You really spent a lot of time thinking about your brief and stuff. This was on your agenda for a while. So roll, 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 play, play, play. And you'll get it perfect. Yeah, no, that's, that's exactly what I wanted, Rashawn. It looks great. Yeah, and then even worn as a three. Looks awesome. I love it. Obviously, it'll fit you better than it fits me. And then even the pen, I'll show you how it looks. You can lock the pin in here for a different look. There you go. Okay?
Nice. And you gotta trust nice. me, you gotta play with this stuff, bro. It is a cool look. Alright? You believe me on that. Don't be shy, I've never been wrong so far. You haven't, that's for sure. So today I tell you what, right? So I got into the train on my end down my place. And when I got out of the train in Central, it was pissing. Okay? I was like, shit. Uh, I'm gonna get soaked. I was going to the Mandarin for breakfast. So you know what I did? Flipped up the collar. Flipped up the collar. It was a savior for me, bro. It saved me. And I was like, you know what? This shit is it's true. Uh, you know, because at least then when I can get to the meeting, right, oh, then I'm not drenched. My collar and tie are not drenched and stuff. And I can just take off my jacket and have that dry off while I've got my waistcoat uh, and shirt on. And that's why these different parts are so important. People forget about the history of dressing when guys didn't have as much cover as we do now to the elements. Uh, and, 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 and basically, like, you know, you know, guy would be in a suit all day going from meeting to meeting to meeting. You, 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 you get what I mean? Whether it's in the office or, or outside. So he had to be prepped for everything. Your pants, buckles. You did say buckles on this one, right? Yeah, yeah. Pocket yes, guard. I did. Matching horn buttons. Shirt stays. Keep the shirt locked in, braces, buttons, crotch guard, and your heel guard. So we mixed it up a little bit different this time, added the pen, added the funky patch pockets and stuff. Uh, we just want to keep everything different. Is that good with you? Yeah, no, I, I, that's part of the whole plan, right? You're happy then? Happy yeah, with I'm everything? Happy with like you said, I had that on the uh, for a while, so. Yeah. Again, so now I need to make you a burgundy suit. <laughs> I'm, I'm still, uh, give me a little bit more time on that one. I'm still pondering and thinking about it. It would be amazing. You are the big bad wolf, okay? <laughs> Don't shirk suddenly. Don't suddenly shirk. You're the big bad wolf, you know what I mean? You are TMM. You are Mr. TMM. You got your own three digits, man. Okay? Don't shirk. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna uh, let me let me think on that one a little bit more. Big I'll get back bad to sure. burgundy. Stay on the stream. See what I got coming up for art. Okay. God bless you, my friend. I'm gonna send oh. you a video of the tr of the trouser length. Okay. And we'll talk real okay. soon. Take care, bro. Thank you so All much right. for being there for All me right. always. Thanks, Thanks Roshan. God All bless right. you. Bye. Bye. Okay. Next, we're gonna call Serge. Very tired today, man. What the hell is wrong with me? Every day. Hey, how's it going? Good, man. How you doing? I've grown my beard out uh, as, a, as an ode to you. You know this, right? I, I, I've noticed. Right? This is for you. I never know. I haven't grown it out this thick in, uh, in a very long time. Uh, either I shave it or I trim it and stuff. Uh, but this is for you. You know, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I promise you that. Yeah, I, I've noticed on some other videos. So yeah. why have I called? Why have I been calling you? Because it wasn't uh, enough what I had done last time, so I just had it to add one little part to it, right? One little frivolous part. Okay. So I'm gonna show you the black suit again, love. And here it is. And can you notice what I've added? Not yet. The pin. Oh, the pin. Okay, yeah, yeah. So you have two pins now, okay? They're both Marzoni pins, and the backing is made from the Marzoni fabric, the Braille. Okay, so I've done a ivory pin and a burgundy pin, okay, for the, as the primary button and the secondary button, okay? Very cool. Yeah. So you can slot these in or omit them completely, and you can use them on your other jackets also, okay? And, you know, yeah. both bare with the burgundy and with the ivory gives you plenty of, plenty of variety, okay? Love now I feel I can send it, all right? Sorry to be a pain in the ass, okay. but uh, after I presented to you last time when we, when we got in and we were about to pack it, I was just like, uh, no, come on, we gotta make these pins. I think it took me longer to get in touch with you than it did to make the pins. Yeah. 
But now I'm starting to be become very legit in your country. You know what I mean? All, all sorts, all sorts of your pop culture heroes are, are, are completely endorsing me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, love it. I love it too. I, I love it. Listen, um, there's one thing I was going to tell you. Yeah, actually, I was, I had a meeting this morning, right, with a very high-ranking government official, and he told me that he was just in San Francisco, right, and these are his words, not mine. He said it's like a ghost town now. He's, yeah. Is that true? Is. He said it's because all because your downtown, your business district and stuff is is tech dominated, and nobody wants to return to work. Everybody's still ha happy uh, working from home. That was one. Number two, most of your visitors are Chinese, and there hasn't been any Chinese people coming for three years. Uh, is is all this true? T Tourism is a little bit better. Um, all the the. the the, the downtown the bigger, yeah. work day stuff is, is definitely true. Um, yeah. It's it's pretty quiet. And then how does that pro uh, um, affect property prices? It hasn't really yet. Um, yeah. There's, there's all kinds of stuff that makes property very... Uh, it's hard to build. So property is going to be expensive regardless. Um, yeah. But, it's like Hong uh, Kong. Commercial real estate is bad. Commercial real estate is bad. Same like Hong Kong. So well, Hong Kong all real estate is bad. We were locked in for so long right and uh the ram ramifications have 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 come to fruition now uh uh negative fruition uh and stuff and uh everything has really taken a beating so i think our central bank has intervened 32 times at least this year to hold on to our peg uh to the dollar uh and, and stuff it's lucky that we have the a war chest as as insane as ours it shows you what a wealthy city we we've had to hang, be able to hang on to the peg. If you take a look at the Chinese uh, yuan, that's at its lowest ever uh, with the dollar. Look at the pound, man. What a beating it's taken. Yeah. Yeah. That's their own fault. Yeah. Agreed. That's fantasy um, economics. And I was saying this. I was saying this before they chose Liz Truss over Rishi Sunak. I was like, listen, this is fantasy economics. You know what I mean? Uh, this is the old school American uh, uh, way of doing things for a short period of time, which led them to trillions of dollars of debt uh, uh, and so forth. And it just didn't make any sense. And even Rishi Sunak, who is effectively, in, in your terms, a Republican, right, uh, was in favor of raising taxes and stuff and knew that he couldn't uh, borrow his way out of this. And, you know, I feel for them, man. It's going to be a long time back. So I heard this story about you guys today, about San Fran, and I felt sad for you guys. And I hope it's okay. But are you going into work? Um, I do uh, a few days a week, not not nearly. I mean, I was there every day um, in, in 2019, 2020, right? Now yeah. it's a couple days a week. And you're happy? Yeah, it works out for me. I think uh, I'd shoot myself, bro, if I didn't, if I couldn't go to work. Seriously, you know what I mean? I, I, I would go more if, uh, if, if there were just more, uh, more reason to. It's just, you know, you go in, you meet a few people, it's just not the same. But are you working constantly on a on a time basis during the day or is it all fragmented i think it's worse uh, i think i work more uh than um when i was in the office yeah so so what time do you wake up every day then Six. okay yeah you're like me you're like me okay so i'm going to get this to you today uh, we're golden so we've completed every project for you you let me know what's next on the agenda i'd like to make you a burgundy suit brother interesting yeah I, i'm interested uh, you should know that every now and then I, I go to the closet, I look at the tux, and I'll just put this on, we'll put the, the jacket on real quick. Isn't it brilliant, it. right? It's absolutely superb, right? Yeah. I told you, one of the best I've made, I told you. Uh, 8,800 tuxedos at bare minimum I've made across my career, and that one's up there. Yeah, I'm, I'm, we're, we're getting close to the, to the, uh, the date, so I'm, I'm excited about it. Burgundy suit, brother. That's what you need, I'm telling you. You have to think about it. I'll talk to you real soon. God bless you, my friend. Take care. Bye bye. Okay, we're gonna do one more call. Everybody, help me to like and share the live. Like and share the live. Uh, I would appreciate that. And then I'll answer some questions afterwards. I am pretty out of it today. Let's not show his phone number yet. Girl, what's wrong with me? And all that sugar at breakfast didn't help me. I'm telling you, I have become like world championship class, like Olympic. Hi, how's it going? Good, good, great. So final touches on your garment. Yeah, 
Ready for it? Ready. Yeah. Uh, I'm just going to do this quick call right now with you. And then uh, when I'm feeling uh, more myself, I will uh, do a consultation with you. Okay? Great. I had, this, I had this meeting uh, with this government official this morning, a uh, high-ranking government okay. official. And, you know, I think that's taken most of my strength and stuff. And I'm not my usual charming self. Uh, I ate breakfast okay. for the first time in like two years. And I think that's completely messed me up. Seriously. I feel so weird. Yeah. You know what I mean? Normally, I, I think last time I ate breakfast when I had breakfast with him in December 2020. I'm serious. I haven't had, I haven't had breakfast in 20 years. I don't know. I'm at a breakfast theater. Yeah. You know what I mean? I, I, I need to stay lean. So so that's one of the ways I, I you know, it just, it's easy for me to skip breakfast and, you know, work out an empty stomach. Especially after working out, I don't even like eating for a while. You know, to me, I'd rather work out and wait till I uh, have a, you know, lunch. Okay. Well, look, I'll let you go back to sleep in a second, but I want to show you uh, the final touch on this jacket, okay? I'm just going to say something else here. I can't remember what it was. Um, you know who Joe Rogan is, right? Oh, absolutely. He's, He's big, big, the biggest. You saw what he did, right? Yes, it was great. So we talked about, we talked about this now for a th third day in a row, and the final touch is this. Can you yep. see it? Perfect. Okay, so let me unbutton it. And the final touch, I, I couldn't envision going any longer than that. No, no, that's exactly perfect. So this is what you wanted, correct? Yes. Okay, let me just put it on one more time to see how it looks. And I'm trying to play, I'll try and play it with the collar a little bit. Slip this on. It's feeling good again. I really love it. Really love it. I need you to love it. Forget about me. Okay, yeah, we can see it straight away. Okay, I don't even need to button it up. You've got, you've got that, yeah. that old school look that you desire. Okay, yeah, the roll is there. Straight away, we see the roll. I just hope your arms are a lot skinnier than mine, brother. Uh, probably not. I love this outfit. I really love it. Looks it. Great. it just looks great. It looks great on everything. It looked great on me yesterday, and it looks uh, great on me today. Absolutely superb. Okay, dear friend, I'll Thank be you. back in touch soon. Maybe as early as tomorrow. Okay. Okay. Uh, and we will uh, start working on your next outfit. And I, I just want to be 100% uh, mentally for you. Uh, in fact, I know you were not on the stream, right? Not at all. So I've just come on, not even 15 minutes ago. So I just came back to the shop. I had this breakfast at the Mandarin, okay, with this guy, uh, you know, talking about, you know, how I could possibly help him uh, it, it, either now or in the future uh, and stuff. You know, I had breakfast with him a couple of years ago. Uh, and my political career had a nice spike after that. I'm not saying it had directly anything to do with him, but you just never know, right? Um, so just had a convo with him and stuff, you know, I'm, you know, when I last had breakfast with him, it was November or December 2020. Uh, I'm, I'm more mature, right, and more accomplished uh, uh, since then. Uh, so let's see, you know what I mean? Fingers crossed for me that, that, that things feel good. Honestly, like, bro, everybody, this cashmere thing that we've made you, they think it's sick. They are loving it. Wow. Seriously, you are the king, brother. You are the king. Thank you. Thank okay. You. I'll be back in touch with you tomorrow. God bless you, my dear friend. Thank you for everything. I'll talk to you soon. Take care, brother. Take care. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bus. Okay. Quick one today. And we've got lots of desk work to do. Doom bank major. Okay. All right, everybody. What you got for me? Sorry I was late today. I did warn you guys yesterday. Hello, Junaid. How are you doing? Hey, Richie. I've missed you. I think you might be up tomorrow, Richie, potentially. Hello, Danielle. I did tell you yesterday that I might not stream today, or, and if I do, it could be late. I, 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 I was, I did warn you of that. Um, really, I'm not feeling myself. God bless Florida, uh, J. Rue. Uh, hello, Janaid. Hello, AJ Soto. Good morning, Kwame Dam. Uh, hey, Big Dave, always in the house. Good morning, Lisa. Hello, O'Tears. Hello, Gian Coco. 
Nice to see you here. Hello, twat shot. Good morning, Danielle. Leather face leather, that's what I specialize in. That's what I invented, the 4D fit. Uh, glad you like the product, tat twat shot. Uh, I spoke to Tom Segura yesterday. And also, I think he mentioned me again in his podcast yesterday. He pulled out his phone and started reading some messages from our uh, our chat together. Leatherface Leather. Breakfast is for babies. Uh, if I could curb on dinner, then I would be having a massive breakfast with champions. I'd probably be super lean and stuff. But I can't settle unless I have dinner, so I have to skip breakfast. Um, twat shot. Does it not l like lay all the other coats we see? Is it me or does it not lay like all the other guys? I don't even know what the fuck you're saying, brother. I have no idea. It's not even a fucking coat. There's no backing inside. There's nothing. Thank you, Richie. No to our shot. I am the hottest guy on earth. If you didn't realize that by now, I'm far hotter than uh, Joe Rogan. Thank you, AJ Soto. Yes, Dan R, the fun jacket. Everything gift, wrap, gift wraps my clients. Uh, everything that I make, leather face leather for them. No Tarzan buttons on any of these projects, Dan R. Uh, jacket is fantastic. I don't know which ones you guys have been talking about, Lisa. I will gift wrap Joe Rogan uh, just for you and Goldberg put us together. Uh, what lining? What lining for what? Um, Guys, when the cameras have, <laughs> when I'm talking to the clients, I can't see what the fuck you guys are typing. You know what I mean? So I don't know. You know, I threw, I showed off three garments. I have no idea what you guys are talking about. Peak of this pocket square, correct? Danar. I'm not sure if the peak is spelled this way though. The way you're spelling it, peak as in peak this way. Um, uh, the real sushi joint. Thank you for your love and congratulations. I'm grateful to you, Captain Gaethje. Thank you, Danar. Ninety six. Thank you, uh, Twat Shot. Thank you. Uh, the, the horn buttons and patch pockets are brilliant. The waistcoat is just evolution for Tim, Lisa. Uh, I love the line too, Captain KG. We're talking about Tim's jacket. It's absolutely brilliant, isn't it, uh, Dan, Dan R96? Is Art in here? I don't know if he's on the stream now, Dan. Big Dave, I'm glad you like the lining, so do I. N Goldberg, is it a big Jewish festival right now? The real sushi joint art is a legend. I've got everything but chains and whips, correct? I don't really need chains and whips. I have my limbs and my mouth and my nose and my appendages. Tim's uh, twat shot. Tim's three-piece suit is fantastic, Lisa. Gosh, that breakfast is like a sugar rush, seriously. But not in a positive way. Uh, thank you so much, Lisa. I, I, I'm grateful to you. Big Bad Burgundy is the way to go. And Goldberg... Pocket guard is just something to protect against wear and tear uh, on the pockets. I've, I've showed it so many times, Big Dave. Uh, when I skip over stuff, I skip past stuff. It's just because, you know, it's too much repeat for the regular viewers. Mm. We got art on the line. Thank you, Lisa. Yes, it's great that I added a pin for Surge. I'm not going to sleep at all, uh, sans shot. I just don't sleep. Uh, I, I could never work from home, Bob's your dad. Seriously. Art is the king, Lisa. I feel terrible after eating this breakfast, Lisa. Yeah, Art jacket does look more amazing anytime I see it. Uh... Ah, oh, Dinar is right. It's a vintage look and it's totally the talk of the town. Yep, 100%. It's like a vintage bag as a men's jacket. Twat shot, you know your shit. The Piacenza cashmere jacket is so beautiful and it feels so amazing, Kwame Dam. Uh, actually, you know, so... Uh, I don't like to dictate. I actually love what I do. I don't want to make stuff and then mass produce it. Oh, by the way, I forgot to say... I was walking past Dior yesterday, a lunch meeting yesterday. I was walking past Dior and guess what they had in the window? Oxygen seersucker suit. Can you believe that? Blue oxygen seersucker suit. Not the, the classic striped seersucker. Um, 
what I've been saying, my job is keep you ahead of the curve. Now Dior are doing one of my signature pieces. And this always happens. This is the history of my career. You guys got to listen. You know, when I tell you big bag burgundy, trust me, uh, uh, I know my shit. I'm a visionary. Anyways, like I said, I like to make stuff with people, unique stuff. I don't like to create and dictate. Uh, I don't like to dictate and create and push finished products. So yeah, I'm not interested, but Sushi Join, I appreciate everything that you say and do for me and all your well wishing. But no, I'm not coming out my own line of jackets. It's not what, I, what I'm into. Um, I love it that I'm on YMH as well, Boy Wildish. I mean, this is like four appearances now. Thank you, Richie. You're the smartest man on the internet. I guarantee you that. Uh, JCSK, I hope Joe Rogan orders his next suit from me as well. Leather face, leather, twit, 4D is what I do. Uh, twat shot, no need to apologize. Uh, best thing to do is start with a black jacket, boy wildish. Goes with everything. The pins has sick detail, uh, leather face, leather. You guys have seen all my evolution, my, my regular viewers. Uh, hand set, my, starts, my suit started 650 US. Uh, official Harris Khan, uh, you are the you are the one who coined me the TikTok tailor. I will never forget you. Thank you so much. Uh, I have a few watches. This is what I'm wearing today, Harris. Uh, John Blaze, uh, I wear my pants low but very very tight, uh, and I can't wait to work with you. Send me your measurements to the measurement chart on my website. Then I can make you something amazing. I think everybody watches me to a, to a shot. Uh, I was thinking that yesterday. I'm like, you know, they're managing to get a lot of inspiration from me. I'm, I'm surprised nobody's asked me to come and design for them. But again, that's not what I do. Uh, I'm way ahead of the curve, Lisa, you know it. So I'm going to get out of here and I'll be back tomorrow 100% and I'll be on fire tomorrow. Bob Dad, Jeremy Smith, Tim McLaughlin, official Harris Khan, Kenneth Ertman, Lisa, Danielle, Tom, Tam Swardman, Leatherface, Twat Shot. Big Dave, JCSK, Kyle Markarian, JP, Mike White's new account. Mike White, I need to make you something. Adam Adam Quam, Casey Chodney, thank you for all your love. Zol Cock, Lauren Innes, Michelle Sickenlegs, and Daniel Bird, I am grateful to you. No, bro, I can't do that, man. I, I just I come across as, as a fucking douche if I did a watch collection video. I'll show it to you when I see you in person here. Have a great day, everybody. God bless you guys. You guys are amazing. Yeah, my schedule is just a bit thrown off, otherwise I'm fine.